Hey, welcome to our PineStrip how to's. Today, I'm showing you how to set your position size to a fixed amount. This, by the way, is crucial when backtesting trading strategies because it removes the bias from the compounding effect and gives a clearer view of your actual strategy's performances. So let's get to it. It pretty much happens all in the strategy header. The first thing you need to define is a default quantity type. And very important, this you need to set to strategy.cash. But you don't need to specify what cash you're doing. By doing this, by setting this, you will be automatically using the quote currency. Here in the example, it is US dollar. So quite naturally, the second thing you need to define is the amount that you will enter your trades with. So this fixed amount. So this is done using this default quantity value. And you see here, I've put 50, meaning I will enter all my trades with 50 of what? Of my quote currency, that is here, US dollars. And actually, that's it. Everything is set. So you don't need to come here in the strategy entry and define this quantity argument that you might use sometimes. In the case of a fixed amount position, you don't need this quantity. We have already set up everything here, thanks to these two arguments. Now you can also see with this approach that the net profits displayed in the backtest evolve linearly with the quantity value that you put here. So with 50 and this example, we get a net profit of about $250. Now if I double this amount and put a hundred here, you will see that we get about the double, 500 US dollars. Great, pretty easy. Anyway, I'll put this code on our GitHub as usual, so you can grab it for free in case you need it. If you found this content helpful, please give us a little like and consider subscribing as well. Until next time, take care.